Hai, uh, Mas Mr. Yo. Hai, I'm Tarik Wan. Saya sebab ini. Okay, Can please take a seat. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Thank you for How's your me. drive down here? Are you drive or are you? Oh, it's okay. I just take MRT. MRT. Yeah. Okay. All right. You, you, you make yourself uh, comfortable. comfortable. Yeah. Have some sweets and all that. If not, okay. Uh, you know, out of uh, this is just protocol. Uh, I just need to verify that you are who you are. So can I have your oh, sure. identification card? Yeah. Just. Okay, right. Okay. Thank yeah. you. Uh, are, are you aware why why you are here? Uh, yeah, it's coming to do assessment. 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 Yeah. Well, one is to do the workplace. Yeah. One to do the on okay. the on, uh, on the product and services. Product and services. Yeah. 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 I think the reviews is on. Okay. So, okay. All right. Let me explain to you the process that we're going to do. There are two parts of it. In fact, there are three. The first one is I'm now giving you on the assessment process and then the second one will be we'll proceed to the role playing. Of course I will explain the props and that. And then that will take probably about 30 minutes and then another 10 to 15 minutes will be on the oral questioning. Okay. So that's just two three parts all together. Yeah. So uh, it shouldn't be more than 40 minutes on the Okay. So and then um, now this being the nature of an assessment, you know, there's such thing as passing and failing. In our term, we call it competent or not yet competent. Okay. So, if you are competent, then there's no issue. Mm -hmm. However, if it falls in the second category where I assess you as not being competent, then you have the right to appeal. Okay. okay. And I will explain to you the appeal process when we come to it. Yeah. Okay. 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 Now, uh, you know, this I E uh, I E L this building is we are bound to have things like, you know, uh, a pleasant thing maybe you set on fire and all that stuff, so safety and all that. So I think to cut the story short, you'll just follow me when the thing happens. Okay. Obviously, you wouldn't want that to happen. Yeah. Yes, that's okay. 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 Yeah. All right. And then, uh, like what I'm doing now, I will be doing note taking because mm -hmm. we need to gather evidence uh, to see whether you actually justify my uh, decision to pass him or fail it or the computer not computer okay now now this thing is confidential so you can only be assessed by me the assessor and of course the all the IEL personnel mm -hmm. uh, yeah so and and if they need to view it they do but rest assured that it will not be passed on or to be viewed by any other people okay okay all right so, so far you understand whatever they have yeah, so far so okay, yeah. okay. and uh, Okay, can I just check whether you have any form of special needs or mm, not that uh, not that well. Okay. So you're all good for the assessment. Yeah. Okay. Good. And then so if you're ready to start, then we can move. Can proceed on? Yeah. Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring you over the other side to right. explain to you the props. Okay. Okay. Over here. So the shop will be ABC shop. Okay. So you're selling handphones. Mm -hmm. These are the range of phones that you have down here. The, the, the prices are labeled accordingly mm -hmm. from the, the most expensive to the least expensive. Okay. And we also have promotion down here. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the charger, the casing, okay, down here, this is fifteen dollars mm -hmm. and this is ten dollars each. Okay, so uh, being promotion, this thing will come together with the phones. Okay. And okay. The, 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 get the phone then you can get the promotion price. Yeah. Alright, okay. okay. Yeah. So um, um, a bit more of, of, of what we need to know will be that uh, uh, the customer is on the five hundred dollars budget. Oh, okay. Five hundred dollars budget, and uh, he, he does use the phone for traveling. Mm -hmm. Okay, right. traveling and yeah. And any questions or anything? I think I think we are good. I've given you enough information. Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, ready when you are. Okay. Can. Can. Bye. Okay. All right, I'll be coming from the other side. All right. Hi, welcome to Hello. the ABC shop. Hi. Uh, welcome to the ABC shop. Okay. Uh, hi. Uh, my name is Yo. I'm Talib. Yeah. Hi, Talib. Just take a seat and think of time you choose. Yeah. Okay, uh, anything I can do for you? I am looking for a phone. 
this oh, my phone is being used for some shooting by my friend so okay. I need a phone badly now oh. any yeah. special features you're looking for uh, something that I can do fast charging okay yeah, and I take a lot of photos because I travel a lot okay so that's very important okay. yeah but my budget is about 500 Oh yeah. yeah. So maybe that's the oh yeah. Um, okay, we have. So if talking about your budget, it's going to fall between this so-called um, this BlackBerry and this uh, Samsung phone. Okay. So it's between six hundred five hundred dollars. Okay. Um, but uh, any sort of uh, particular brands you're looking for, or you just think that uh, you can choose anything in the base on the price. Well, I've been using the iPhone, but. Uh, I'm open to any others if it's okay. good enough for me. So yeah. iPhone range is about $1,000. Oh, I can see that there's yeah. Uh, yeah, yes, four digits. But then a Samsung phone is $600. Mm -hmm. And then uh, BlackBerry is $500. Mm -hmm. But uh, it's for my opinion, uh, so obviously Samsung phone will be good. In terms of picture, will be clear. Right? Okay. And uh, one of the features. Also, I hear from you that you want to have, uh, you want to charge. You want to have yeah. a fast charging. Fast charging yeah. Samsung phone will offer you the feature of fast charging. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay so you can actually try it out and uh, see what uh, how you like the pictures because you are using iPhone now, so you have to try on Samsung phone. Yeah. Maybe you like the picture, you want to have a try. Yeah, okay, why, why not? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I can try it out? Yeah, you try it on down there. Okay. Then, yeah. okay. okay. I see people are starting at night. Okay. Mm -hmm. Quite sharp. Okay. Yeah. Can I try the other one? Oh, this one is very, the phone. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Is it, how do I operate the Okay. Let's press on there. Let me see. Oh, the okay. buttons is too small. Huh? Yeah. For my thumb. My fat thumb. So. Okay, now I understand why it's cheaper. Yeah. yeah. And, okay, I... I oh, in terms of features, is, uh, which is the free features that you think people? This is the, the, the resolution, the pixel is better. Yes, better. Okay. This, but this I, this I know I'm not able to afford this, but can I just give it oh, a chance? Oh, yeah, give it a chance. Yeah. Yeah. It's very little like my phone, eh? mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Definitely, definitely, it's much better. It's yeah. much better. Uh, this is much better, uh, but but it is the price range is yeah. yeah. Also, so another to 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 encourage you on yeah. this is, if you get one of this phone, you have this promotion. Oh, price okay. Dollars, yes. Yeah. Case. And as I, as I hear that you, you travel a lot, yes. I mean, this sort of case for protection is very useful. Very useful. And then I put it on there in case you drop in there with the okay. phone and this on there. Okay. On there. Yeah. So, uh, and, uh, what about uh, what about uh, the charger? Yeah, the charger. This is this come with ten dollars. Mm -hmm. uh, so for uh, this for, for, for this uh, single phone, fast mm -hmm. charge phone, and this this charger is only ten dollars. Mm -hmm. So we get phone, uh, Samsung phone is $600, say, say more expensive, say more expensive yeah. but then yeah. they have to give you the oh. feature and also give you the fast charging mode. Oh, okay. Same this. Okay. That's sell and then you have a promotion of $15 for the two. $15 for the two. Yeah. So, okay, the one that you're recommending is actually $600 is off my budget by okay. $100. Mm -hmm. So, um, I was wondering, I probably, it's a bit straight but I don't mind paying this amount if you can throw in these two items, is it possible? Um, well, this this is fifteen dollars. I I I'm okay to throw in this uh, offer this. Uh, okay. For yeah. Charge ten dollars. Yeah. Uh, for a charger. Okay. Yeah. So all all in all, how much do I pay? Oh no, it's actually six hundred fifteen dollars. Then you got three items instead. Ah, uh, okay, six hundred for all the three. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. Sounds yeah. good. How about children? Are children in school? Yeah, yeah, they've been bugging me to get a phone, but uh, I'm not sure whether I'm ready. How about I this one? Uh, these are $50. two very soft economical mm. phones. It's fifty dollars mm. each, and this is Nokia. Mm. And this one is giving you a basic requirement. Oh, it's right. only a ten ten minutes just on the phone call. Right. I think they are they are quite okay for the phone. Okay. Yeah. And even the new city will not cost you that much. Mm. The feature is not the same as. Oh, obviously not. But this is only for basic text messages. Text messages. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I mean, this is will be good for children, and so the size of it is quite small. I see. And can, can sort of bring along to school. Okay. You know what? I, I'll keep in view on this because I'm not prepared to give my, my daughters the phone. Mm -hmm. Because I believe the moment they have the phone, then I will lose my daughter for good. Yeah, so, <laughs> All right. Okay. Uh, okay. I tell you what, uh, I think you made a good offer. I will just go for this one and the other two promotions. Okay, I just get it. Yes, yeah. Take the phone and also the case. Yeah. And then I give you this. Uh, okay.
Yeah. Can you give a new casing? Oh, sure, no problem. Yeah. I will do that, right? Okay, right. now the counter is over there. You know, okay. go there to pay. And okay. then I'll start uh, how, how do I pay? Uh, do I use my card or? Oh, you can use a credit card. Credit card. Okay. Can you? Can. Sure. Right. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay, let's move on to the other side. Okay, you want to take a seat down here? Okay. Then, uh, Okay, how do you how do you go so far just now? Okay. Okay. Uh, I think I'm doing okay. Okay. Uh, good. Good. I'm glad that you are confident. Uh, I tell you what, we will discuss in greater details your performance in a bit. But now we will move on to the second part of the assessment, okay. which is the oral questioning. All right. Okay. So I'm going to ask you a few questions and then you just answer me. Okay. Why is it important to serve? and bid farewell to customers? Well, I think uh, this is important for us as we're presenting the companies and also the products. We need to have the kind of personality. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. That's good enough. Okay. Second question. How do you find out what the customer needs? Well, uh, it's open-ended questions. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, Listen to them, listen mm -hmm. to the customer, ask customer question, open mm -hmm. any question, and this listens to what the customer needs. Mm -hmm. And also offering some suggestions and where they want, uh, what kind of phones they want, what kind of feature they want. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's move on to the next question. When a customer objects to the price of an item, mm -hmm. claiming that other stores are selling it, selling it cheaper, mm -hmm. what would you say? Well, uh, overseas uh, has to be patient and then, uh, fight back and then listen to the customer and okay, fight back in. Are we comparing apple with apples? Mm -hmm. and, uh, are we comparing the right products? And uh, explain to him the features that we have on the phone mm -hmm. and also obviously our promotional items. So promotional items. Okay. 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 Uh, okay. So, so when when they, they post that it's cheaper on the other side, so what 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 can you do? Are you going to uh, say that uh, your item is still better? No, so how I, would you I, I, I will actually say the good things about my products. Okay, I am basically not the ethicals to compare other products. It's not about the good things. Are. Okay, so but uh, and, and the, the manner in which you you just just to make the most of the, the, the quality of our product. Yeah. So perhaps after sales. Okay. Yeah. And anything else that you want to highlight? If let's say you know, if the customer is still not happy that uh, this item is still better, or buying from this shop is better from the other shop. Well, yeah. Well, I said this isn't the customer. Okay. Okay. All right. And then okay. Finally, the final one. Okay. Another two more questions. Sorry. How do you match customers' requirement to your product recommendation? What the customer meet the customer needs. Okay. Yes. What what an example? Yeah, I said what you know I'm talking about the frames that go along the edge and the skins that are there compared to other things. Okay, okay. Yeah, and uh I tell you so see the customers struggling a lot to do something touching the phone, the process on the phone. Actually yeah, the needs. Okay. Okay, let's move on to the last question. Uh, last question. Can you name one reason why you may need to present alternative products to the customer? Well, it's also it is part of our sales, and the products, alternative products part of our sales. Also, we can use these alternative products to, to sell to, to the next suggestions mm -hmm. of the cheapest, cheaper products for the first <coughs> group of people. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you mentioned about promotional items too. Okay, that's that's the end of it. Okay, let's uh, let's review uh, your performance. Okay. Okay, so uh, at the start of it, you how I see I was looking for the approach how the approach your customer uh, according to the organization SOP. Okay, you smile at the customer as he enters the store you make eye contact and then you welcome to uh, ABC shop okay uh, and uh, you even highlight the promotional 
uh, product to the customer without sounding pushy. Okay, so very, uh, what do you call that? Very friendly. Okay. And, uh, and you even ask whether there's any particular item. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, and then after that, um, we are looking at things that whether you can uh, demonstrate whether you use open-ended question and all that I saw, I heard that uh, you mentioned things like uh, what is it used for and all that okay. you try to ask as many questions in order to help the customer find out and you con uh, after that you you clarify question determine uh, the requirement of the customer Okay, and uh, you were listening, like you listening maybe because the customer really uh, am looking forward to get a, a phone uh, urgently. Yeah. Okay, and then uh, you are able to project a positive and professional image. Your grooming is nice, okay, and uh, you you mean patient throughout, and you are confident throughout the interaction with the customer. So you show basic courtesy. Thank you. Okay, so. <coughs> You are able to also build a positive rapport with the customer. I think the customer was, was very comfortable with you. So, and, and you did small talks by, uh, by suggesting the phone for the children. Okay. Okay. And it is done in a very polite and friendly tone. Mm -hmm. And you are being courteous and uh, polite throughout the whole look. The whole transaction. Okay. Yeah, thank you. And then you identify customer's requirement, and then you mentioned about two products, huh? the Samsung and the Samsung and the Blackberry. Yeah. Okay, and then uh, so you explain a range product that meets the customer requirement. So basically, the two lah, like, as I mentioned. Mm -hmm. But and I also explain to you. Uh, so yes, but yeah, it but it wasn't the budget. Uh, budget yeah, explain three items in fact. Uh. One of budget. Okay. So you let them choose the the, the uh, try the, the the phone. Okay. Okay. So you even suggest that so you scope down to the six hundred actually a bit above, above the budget but I think the customer was very happy to actually uh, chop out uh, pop out another hundred and all that. So okay, and then I'm looking for two things that you use questioning technique to draw customer wants and need, which I saw just now, and your your product features or your your, your knowledge of the product is also good. Okay, yeah, uh, and then. Uh, you're also able to demonstrate or promote alternative products, okay? Mm -hmm. But I think the customer was quite fixed to one. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then you highlight the promotion item, okay? Uh, by talking about the $10, the charger, right? Mm -hmm. Charger and $50 uh, casing. Okay, and then you use the opportunity to introduce the fifty dollars phone. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, when it comes to the oral questioning, okay, you portray a professional image and you ask open-ended question, and then you actively listen mm -hmm. without challenging the claim and all that. Okay. Uh, so you did mention about. The customer requirement. So what he needs, he he needs it for traveling a lot, and and probably for his age, you know that. And uh, last but not least is uh, you present alternative uh, product to the customer's need, uh, and you also mentioned about the opportunity to promote, okay, uh, about the promotional items. Okay, all in all, <coughs> so looking at your performance today. Uh, I strongly feel that you are very strong with the role play, mm -hmm. so I feel that you have established customer requirement, you have met the 
and you are competent in that and recommending customers to put the services also you are competent as for the oral questioning you there, there sh there's a no, no problem with answering the questions and and basically you know what is the uh, what's the need for it okay so all in all I am recommending and in fact I I decided that you are see throughout okay okay all right for both the role play and the oral questioning Hello. Hello. Are you hi. here for the assessment? Yes, yes, yes. I'm your assessor, Mr. Talib. You are. My name is Yo. Yo, uh, hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi. Please take a seat. Okay. Make yourself comfortable. You need some uh, candy. Oh, it's okay. Yeah. I just this is my dinner. Yeah. Oh, okay. Right. Uh, can I just like uh, confirm who you are? You know, just okay. as for oh, me. Oh, my. Yeah. Can I just take a look at this sure, sure. Yeah. Okay. So this is you. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. Okay. He says again, yeah, my name is Talib and uh, how was your, your journey here? Okay? Oh, it's okay. Uh, I right. just have dinner, don't take my time. Okay, alright. And uh, do you know what's the purpose of this session? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's some, uh, something to do with uh, assessing uh, my knowledge with morale mm -hmm. and also services. Uh, and in the context of... Uh, 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 yeah, in the context of all places. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in the UK, uh, UK and all that, yeah, okay? Yeah, basically that. So what's going to happen today is that uh, bringing you the whole assessment process. Okay, I will start uh, start off with uh, explaining the whole procedure, and then I will show you the items and all that. There will be two parts of it. One is role play. That will take about probably about 30, 30 minutes, and then another one will be uh, open questioning. Probably another ten call or questioning for another ten minutes. Yeah. So it shouldn't go more than forty minutes or not at all. So okay. okay. So, so and then uh, now it, the nature of being an assessment, there's such thing as passing and failing but in our context we say as competent or not yet competent okay. so now in case if you fall to the second category which is not yet competent okay that is you have the right to actually appeal mm -hmm. and, uh, and I will explain to you the appeal process when we come to that yeah. okay so, all right okay. okay and then okay you know this place uh, we are doing this there are also protocols that we have to follow in case mm -hmm. there's fire or any emergency uh, I want to put uh, aside the, the the, you know the procedure of the explaining and whole thing. Just trust me. Can you just follow me? Can, yeah, that sure, happens, sure, yeah. Sure, okay. Yeah, and then, uh, and this process, so there will be note taking during the assessment. So mm -hmm. I'll probably be moving with the keyboard and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then uh, now all these are documents. Uh, these are confidential matters. So I will be assessing it, and of course, there's the need be for the IAL people to actually assess it too. That's a show that it will not be shared with any other people. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yeah. All right. And then, uh, that uh, do you ex understand all yes. this that yeah. I've explained to you? Yeah. Okay. Now, uh, I just need to know whether there is any particular special needs that you, you have with you. Yeah. Uh, uh, I, I, I don't recall any. You don't have anything. So I think the assessment process of routine should be okay. Shouldn't be a problem. Yeah. Okay. And then, if you are ready, we can start now. Yeah, okay, okay, I'm ready. Yeah. Okay, I'll just explain to you the, what we have on here. So in this scenario, uh, for the we are actually selling handphone. The company is ABC Shops. Okay. And these are the range of products that we are actually selling. Okay. These are the casing. These are the phones, the different variety of phones. Mm -hmm. And it's labeled with the prices and all that. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the, from uh, the most expensive and the least expensive. And, and uh, 
this we have the promotional offers also the adapter for fifteen dollars mm -hmm. if they purchase these items and also the casing ten dollars of this item now if let's say they don't get these items now then these prices will not be the same when they actually come again to buy the product mm -hmm. okay yeah. but then did this one go along with the product right? yeah it goes along with the product yeah but stand alone you're not selling them uh, you, you sell, but if you come on another time, it will be more expensive. Okay. You will not pay this week. Okay. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Are okay. you good with that? Okay, I, I think I'm, I'm okay. Okay, so I will be acting as the uh, client and okay. be coming the in as the customer. So so um, if you are okay, then we can get the ball rolling. Okay, okay. Thank okay. you, no Okay, I'll be coming from there. Okay, okay. A charger, charger. Uh, okay. So, what is the difference between? Uh, oh, this one is a promotion, fifteen dollars. Fifteen dollars. Yeah. So that means I can just buy straight fifty dollars off hand down there. No, no, not quite sure. I think you need to buy this one and this. You buy buy oh. the phone and you get you get this one promotion. But this one I think is standalone. I'm not quite sure. So you sure that, that, that <coughs> is there any way that you can actually confirm? Yeah. Uh, I'm not quite sure, but I think it's, the price is $15, but okay. I think you have to buy the phone, then you can get the $15. Oh, okay. But if you buy a loan, I don't think it's going to sell $15. Is there any way that you can actually confirm with your... Yeah, the supervisor just lend. Or just lend? Okay. 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 Oh, this one is a cheap phone. Uh, it's very very simple phone. It's okay. only four text. Mm. Uh, uh, okay. So yeah. So but the price range is different. Eh? I mean, this is it's all about the same size, but this is big difference in the pricing. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. This one must be the old, old model. Old model. Uh, this is a new model. Okay. Yeah. I can see that the, the state of the phone is old. So how can I confirm uh, that this thing is really good for me? I think about the yeah, the taking photo of us. It's about the same. About the same. Maybe the, the, maybe this one is because because the iPhone is very popular. Maybe it's expensive. Okay. You're not you're not sure, eh? So I mean, how how to justify that this I, thing? I, I, I don't know. You can try now. Sure. I can try. No, okay. Can try yeah. Then you can compare and see. Okay. You know how many pixels of this are the, for the photo? What's that? Uh, the pixel, you know, it's in the sharpness of the, no, the I'm picture. Not, I'm not quite sure on that. Okay, is this working or not? Yeah, it's working. Oh, it's working? Yeah, it's working. Okay. And then compare with this one, maybe it's 3 and 4, it's 5 and 4, maybe this oh. one compare with this one. I haven't finished uh, seeing this thing. Okay, can I just try this? I just need to give you a... Yeah. Can you confirm with your with your your boss or something whether this promotion uh, is just today only or maybe I or oh, it's, it's, it's only promotions uh, during a promotion period only. after and that this price will be different. when is the last day of your promotion? Two weeks down the road. Two weeks down the road. So, so I do have time now to, to, to make okay. Alright, uh, okay. Yeah. So but I understand that you get one phone here, then you can buy this on ten dollars. 
ten dollars. So so you get you get, get you need to buy one of this one. Then this one is ten dollars. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, I'm not sure whether. Uh, basically, I I travel a lot. You see, so um, I I don't see really the. the but just now you compare the phone version to a shuttle picture. Yeah, but because just like it started off okay, but after that it died off. So I'm not sure. Do you have a charger or something that I can charge? Because no, I will travel a lot. You see, yeah, yeah. So no, ch ch well, charging you can use this charger. Just charging is for this phone. Oh, okay, okay, all right, okay. Okay, uh, I'm not sure because you're not sure, so I probably need more time to think about it. You said two, two weeks, right? Yeah, two weeks. You can come back two weeks. Time. I can I mean, come back this two weeks. Time. Time. Okay, uh, alright. And, and the price will be the same? It will really yeah, yeah, it's still promotion time. I will uh, find out more, then you'll come back and I'll, I'll tell you. Okay. Well, is there, no, I'm working, I'm busy and all that, so is there any way that I can actually call you? No, or I can call you. Call sorry, the shop. sorry, your name again? Uh, yeah, you. You, uh, okay, so maybe I can. Uh, you can call the shop and I'll tell you. I'll call the shop. You're working throughout? The, the yeah, yeah, for a photo of the two. I just, okay. I, just, I just came to this company. Oh, you, oh okay, I see, I just see. Joined. Uh, because, uh, you know, I travel a lot and all that. I'm not sure about my schedule, but I, I worry that I miss the, the promotion. Okay, period. Yeah, okay, this year, two weeks, I'm not too worried. Two weeks, huh? Yeah, I'm not sure that I'll be required to travel. I have to check. Mm, okay. Yeah, yeah. No but maybe you can firm up and tell Yeah, yeah, I'll let you know. You call me, I'll let you know. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know how to con contact me or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, can I just give you my okay. name card? Take it Yeah, so, yeah, okay, that's my previous uh, motor card. I think I'll make a, a decision another time. Yeah. Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Sorry, sorry. Okay, all right, okay. Okay, uh, let's, let's move on to, to the open questioning, or oral questioning, rather. Thank you. So how do you think you did for the road day? No, I was a bit nervous. Nervous, huh? Yeah. So I think not for you. Okay, well, I can feel that too. Yeah, because I feel the same way, actually. Yeah, okay. Uh, I'm going to ask you a few questions, and then uh, you just uh, explain to me mm -hmm. or, or try to think what you know for the questions. Okay, uh, first question. Why is it important to serve green and bid farewell to customers? Well, I think it's important, I go for this company you must you must be very confident. Yeah. 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 Tell tell find out what customer want and you then tell the thing for Okay. And, and reason why to be confident in all that uh, what what are you you are working for the company, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you, what do you need to show actually with that confidence? Yeah, just show, 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 just show that we're working for this company. Then we know the, we know the products are no, yeah. oh, Okay, know the product. Huh? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. Know products, yeah. Something okay. Like okay. I'm not under it. I just, just like I'm new here. Okay. 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 Uh, and then, uh, how do you find out what the customer need? How do you find out? Well, ask, ask the customer what he wants. Ask, ask the customer what he wants. Huh? Okay. That's what you want. Then you tell me what you want. Oh, oh, yeah. So what, what kind of question would you would you ask? Yeah. Well, I ask him um, uh, what, you, what you want, you know, what phone do you want. Okay. That kind of thing. Okay. Uh, okay. Something like that. Okay. So, yeah, I, 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 I mean, I will definitely improve and I gain more experience. But you, you, you're confident that you, you, you will improve? Huh? Yeah, I mean, I, I, I will work and I will improve. Oh, okay. All right. So, okay. Then, let's move on to the next question. Okay. Uh, when the customer object to the price of the item, uh, they don't agree, and then claim that the other store uh, sells at a cheaper price, what would you say? What would you say? You say, let's say, uh, I'm there to sell it for you. I do not come across this before, so I do not know what to do. Oh. Okay. Maybe I just send coming down and talk to him or something like that. Calm down, calm, calm him down. Huh? Okay. Uh, we talk to him and things like that. Oh, no. I really don't know. They have too much experience. Oh, you, you will talk that, uh, that you don't have the experience? Huh? Yeah, because I have to have the My team can't call this kind of thing before. Okay. Okay.
Okay, and then uh, how do you match customers' requirement to your product recommendation? Mm. No, for now, he wants uh, no, then, then no, no matter he wants this, uh, if not, then I ask for another, give him another offer and suggestion. Uh. Is, there, is there any high, is there any area that you want to scope down that you, when, when you are finding out what, what are the things that you want to find out? No, just find out what kind of phone you want. And then what, what type, okay, a example of the type? The, the example of the, what type of phone you want, is this really, really happy, and then you have to just tell him how much, how much the price is. Oh, okay. No, I mean, honestly, it's different. depend on him, tell me what he wants. Okay, what about uh, maybe the customer in the port or something like that? Yeah, yeah, probably I will ask the question. Okay, alright. <coughs> okay, come to the last question. Uh, can you name one reason why you may need to present alternative products? The customer buy more. Buy more? But, but, but the customer only needs one, right? Yeah, but then, okay, ask him to choose some product you want to choose. Choose, okay. Choose the product which one he wants. Okay, but, 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 uh, well, he, he, would you ask him the budget or something, right? Yeah, I, I will ask him the budget, I'll say, say, five hundred dollars, okay, this one, okay. give him the five hundred dollars phone. Okay. And then, just say, uh, depend what I know about the phone now. If I know okay. the phone better, then probably tell me to know. Okay, is there anything else that you can add on to this? The last question? Reason why you need to present alternative product? You know, like give, give more choices to, 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 to the customer. Give more choices? Mm -hmm. Sure. Mm -hmm. Other than what is displayed? Oh. Is it? Yeah, this, I mean, that's, that's okay. all that I know. Okay. Give more choices. Sure, sure, sure. Right? Mm -hmm. Okay, Mr. Yo, we have come to the end of it. We have done the role play and we have done the oral questioning. And then now we have to discuss about your performance. Okay, so I have to go through the whole thing. Okay? Is it okay that we, we just go through it? Yeah, yeah, okay. sure, sure, sure. <coughs> right, uh, so you are expected to approach the customer according to the organization SOP. Okay? Mm -hmm. You started off okay, you had a smile. You, you did make some kind of effort in, in eye contact, but somehow rather it goes off. Uh, uh, goes off. I don't see much of that after a while. Okay. Uh, what what, what do you mean go off? No, you, after that, you, you, you because I sense that you don't make that eye contact to show that you're confident about your product. Like initially, it was okay. The greeting part is fine, no, but after that, uh, so. I, I'm not sure whether you actually greet me to the shop. Yeah. Okay, the language is okay. When you talk, it's quite okay. And then, uh, you did say about the promotion offer, but that is after the customer asked. After I asked. Mm -hmm. You know, that, that, that should be an initiative on your side. Uh, okay. And uh, but I thought I'm, I'm doing okay because I, 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 I ask and I give you the answer. Yeah. But you see, the thing is that uh, what I can sense is that you are not confident about your product knowledge. Uh, so that's my main, my main concern about that. And then uh, you should have started off with asking about the budget at the at the start of it. So, but when uh, when I actually mentioned and uh, out of my initiative as a, as a customer, for then straight away you just scroll down to one and then. Oh, well, if the customer ask, tell me only five hundred dollars, so I just give him five hundred dollars, the five hundred dollars. Okay, but but that, I think there's there's more that you can do, right? And you must find out about uh, what the customer needs. So what is needed is open-ended question, which you didn't ask. That means you try to get more information mm -hmm. from the customer, see the budget, and then what, uh, what's the the use of it, you know? And I, I have to tell you, so that that should become. Uh, your initiative to actually ask about that. So once you already got the details, then you come up with the close question, which I didn't see that lah. Mm -hmm. Okay, then you have to clarify. You didn't clarify. What, what, what is this? Uh, 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 
NYC. Okay, NYC is not yet competent. There's things that I actually have not seen, uh, which is important. So those. So what happened if I got NYC? Ah, uh, okay. So uh, let me go through the whole process first. The whatever that I have not seen, and I tell you, okay. So there must also be uh, active listening by non non verbal cues also, okay. And uh, but, but I listen to you, right? Yeah, you listen, uh, but the, then again, the sensing throughout the whole thing uh, is that I, I don't feel the, 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 that, that you know the, the, the product knowledge and, and more or less you don't give the confidence to the customer that, hey, this is the choice that you should be making, that kind of thing, you know. So that's why the customer do not want to make the commitment to make the purchase. So as you can see, after that, I actually left mm. and I said I'll come back later. Yeah. So, uh, Okay, uh, so uh, I, at the end of it, I didn't, didn't buy, you know, because uh, the customer interest is not there yet. So, uh, your grooming, you are good, yes, I can see that uh, you are smart looking, yeah. Uh, and uh, the confidence part, that, that's exactly what I'm trying to say, that's not that. You, you are, the, the courtesy part, politeness, is okay, mm -hmm. alright? And then... Uh, there was no small talk at all, you know, trying to convince, you know, because I said that I'll come back again. You, you I wasn't see much of an effort to actually try to get the customer to commit. Mm, but I see that the, the two weeks, two more weeks promotion, you come back anytime. Right? Yeah, but the thing is that if you you can be more upfront, say okay, you, you know, you just okay, you can contact me this number. I will definitely call mm. the manager, and he did mention about making the call, uh, call to the manager, and then you see that your manager have already left. Okay, so the thing, um, yeah, but okay, uh, polite and friendly, you are not rude at all, that, that is quite okay, yeah, and you are courteous in a way lah, throughout, okay, uh, identifying customers need, I think this is the area where you can actually work on, and you explain one product and not so much in details of the other, yeah, okay, uh, yeah, the customer can actually see like the range of phones that down there, but uh, there's a display there, right? Yeah, the display. Yeah, but maybe you can display your product knowledge, uh, so that the customer knows the variety and, mm -hmm. and what they have. They have a choice because they're the one ultimately paying for it. Well, I allow the customer to try the phone. You know, yeah. The phone itself. Okay, and then the, the phone wasn't fully charged, uh, so that he died off in, in 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 the process of that trying out. So, so more proactive action that done on your side uh. okay uh, all right and then uh, active listening I think you can actually do more listening mm. okay and <coughs> questioning technique is not there uh, most important is the product knowledge I think you need to brush up on the product knowledge uh, so in order to no, I'm, I'm, I'm just I'm just new yeah that's what, exactly that's why they call it uh, not yet competent so you need to Work on that product. What happens if, if not competent? Then ah, and okay. Last, let let's go part to this because we are still talking about the the role playing. Yeah. So promote, uh, present an uh, alternative. Uh, what we call that, uh, alternative product also is still has to come from the customer. So you need to be more proactive in that sense. Ah, uh. uh, and then uh, you didn't get the chance to. Take the opportunity to introduce other product because why basically your product knowledge is not there yet okay so mm -hmm. so that's the thing okay now let's come to the oral questioning so you uh, when it come to oral question i asked is it important to serve and greet and bid farewell to the customer you you wasn't sure actually you were, you were saying ask you keep on saying that asking more question more and asking what they want what they want so more yeah uh initially you had you show a good Impression uh, about being neat, you know, your dress, uh, okay, that that's uh, your dressing is good, uh, but uh, yeah, and you respect, uh, you respect the benefit of the, the doubt that you're okay, yeah, but problem is that uh, there, there is lacking in product knowledge, as I said again, so, and then uh, you. But that kind of thing you can learn along the way, right? Yeah, yeah. so and that's why I said, uh, when we talk about not yet competent, that means you need to know more, and then and probably have to be reassessed again uh, in that sense. So all in all, uh, if we were to look at it, we have, I have, let's talk about the two most important components, established customer requirement. Role playing is, uh, I don't think that you are competent yet. 
and uh, and then recommend customer goods and services because you don't know the the the, the product that well. That's why I think that you are not. If you if you put me in, uh, not check confidence, uh, what happened to me? Then the customer, uh, the company will buy me and get a job. Uh, okay, that one you have to go back to your company and ask the procedure on that. Yeah. Okay. So so open and the uh, oral questioning also you didn't display enough uh, to show that you are ready okay and uh, so I think you I have to make a decision that uh, I don't think that you are competent enough to actually uh, pass this module on self yeah but you could not say, not say competence then I will be fired when I go back to the office okay that you have to check with your but I have to be very objective that uh, that you have to Demonstrate. I need to see evidence that you you are competent and ready for the job. So so that you need to sort out with your. Yeah, but you give me a bit of grace. I think it's the first time I'm doing I'm doing yeah. some demo. Yeah. You can be nervous and things like that. Yeah, I'm sorry, Mister. You I have to be very objective about this, lah. So like just now, now I'm I'm sorry that you have really come to the part whereby I assess you and you are not being competent. Mm. So. Um, but then you need to have a bit of grace on me, lah. Because I've just did the mm. first time I'm doing this. I'm nervous. I can't give you an answer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, yeah, we have gone through the 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 uh, what do you call that the assessment process, and uh, as I said again, if that's it, you want to, you don't agree or you want to appeal, there's this procedure in which you can actually adopt. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I'm explaining to you what the, the the process now. So what you can do is that uh, probably the IEF personnel will be checking, uh, uh, getting back to you. And they will tell you the procedure, okay? No, but so I, I definitely want to appeal, right? Okay, so you want to appeal? Job. Okay, I have already explained to you the, the process, okay? And you also want to lodge the appeal, uh? mm -hmm. okay? So, all right. So I have assessed you as not being competent. Is your right that, that uh, you want to appeal? Mm -hmm. that so I need your your name and your signature down here. But then this is the first time that you should give me a bit of chance, right? Uh, I have to be very objective. I have to follow by the checklist that is given. Yeah, but you, you didn't give me a chance. Okay, so we have already come to the end of the meeting. Is there any feedback that you want to give about this uh, assessment process besides? Uh, well, I don't think you, I think it's not fair for me the first time. Uh, yeah, but then a bit of grace. I have to be very objective. Uh, I said again just now, and uh, I have to base my assessment of uh, on what I see. So I, if I've not seen enough to pass you, then I'm afraid that uh, you probably have to redo it again. But then again, it will be up to the IEL people to decide. Yeah. Well, no choice, right? Yeah, I'm sorry. Mm. Uh, I have to make a decision. Yeah. Okay, that, that's right. Yeah. No choice. Okay. Uh, so, thank you for your time. Yeah, sorry again. Yeah. Mm. Okay.